Sarah, I cannot believe this day is finally here. I am so unbelievably happy. I'm so happy to be able to tell you I do, I will, and I always will. You're beautiful in every sense of the word. You're the most caring, selfless person I know. Don't let this get to your head, but you're also pretty funny. <laughs> Sarah, while I have loved you for the past 10 years, what I love most about you and our relationship is the evolution of the depth of our love and commitment to one another. We started off as 16-year-old high school sweethearts. We shared a locker, and now we're gonna share a last name. And through our time together and our many years apart, we grew individually and as a couple. Because of this unique connection that we built with one another, I'll forever be the luckiest man on earth. For those who don't know, I'm Sarah's sister. I'm forever grateful for her loyalty. She has always been there for me, even when I thought I didn't want her to be. She has always been an amazing big sister, and I'm sure that that's just one of the great qualities that Joe sees in you. And as for Joe, I've looked up to him as a big brother for a really long time now. I'm so happy for these two. They not only made it 10 years, different schools and states and distance, but Joe also hasn't run away yet, so. <laughs> I think it's safe to say you guys are gonna have a really wonderful long life together. For those of you that don't know me, I am Matt. I'm not Joe. <laughs> I'm not Joe disguised with the mustache and glasses, although I've always looked up to you as your younger brother. And I've wanted to do the same as you did from day one. Quit baseball for lacrosse, work at the movie theater, drive the Beamer, break down in the Beamer, <laughs> go to school in Colorado, and grow a great mustache. You get the point. While Joe's been around me for my entire life, I've known Sarah now for almost half of my own life. You've been so much more to me than just someone my brother dated, and I'm so happy now that I get to call you my sister. To the new Mr. and Mrs. Gridone. Before this moment, you have been many things to one another. An acquaintance, a friend, a companion, a lover, a dancing partner, and even a teacher. For you have learned much from one another in these last few years that anyone could know. Now you shall say a few words that take you across a threshold of life, and things will never quite be the same between you. For after these vows, you shall say to the world, this is my husband and this is my wife. It's been over 10 years in the making, of this day and we are finally here. Today is a day of reflection for me. All the memories that we have collected. Sarah, it's your drive, perseverance, and determination that led you to where you are today. Welcome to the family, Joe, even though you've been a part of the family for a long time now. Uh, beautiful. I see how the love for each other has survived and grown. What do you think? Beautiful. We're extremely proud of both of you and that all of you have accomplished. One, two, three, left. Oh, oh, and I wish you both happiness, success, and above all, health. We love you both. Since August 13, 2010, I've been asking myself, is this real life? How did I get so lucky to be so healthy, to have a loving family, to have friends so supportive, and to have you? How did I get so lucky to find you? You are so sweet beyond measure and truly my very best friend. Looking back at all those years, all the memories we've already created, I realized I always knew it was you. I found all that I could wish for in you. And today, when I take your name, I promise to take on the rest of our life together without compromise, without any conditions. I vow to love you, no matter the distance, 
to learn from you, to honor you with an unwavering confidence, to take care of you in sickness, and to celebrate your health, to have children with you, to praise you as the wonderful father that you will be. To cherish each moment we have until our last and then some. I vow to you, I vow to us. I love you endlessly. I am so excited to be your wife. So I take you, Sarah, to be my wife. I promise to find a way to show you how much I love you every single day of our lives. I promise to be the man that I see in your eyes today tomorrow and forever. I promise to create and support a loving family with you in a home filled with laughter, patience, understanding, and love. I promise to support you, push you, inspire you, and above all, love you, for better or for worse, in sickness and in health, as long as we both shall live. And I promise that when we are old and gray, we'll look back on our lives together and smile. From this day forward, you'll never walk alone. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss your bride.